Alrighty, namaste. My name is Illy B, and welcome to Daily Vibes for the Collect Hive. Today is December 5th. Happy birthday. Happy trip around the sun to whoever's birthday it is out there. I'm sending you lots of love, blessings, joy, happiness, bliss for all of your days. Yeah. So I'm switching things up a little bit. So for those that are new, welcome. Um, for those that have been watching, let me know what you think. So instead of doing um, a grounding meditation before these videos, I'm going to do it afterwards. So like really getting the passages in and then sitting with it and meditating on it. Okay, so before we begin, yeah, let's start off with some pa book passages. Being in charge, our strength is often composed of the weakness we're damned if we're going to show. So, how in the world did I get to be in charge? There must be some kind of mistake. I don't know what to do with this contract. I don't know how to raise the kids. I must have misrepresented myself for them to believe that I knew what I was doing. I am secretly at my best when someone else has this ultimate responsibility. Who has made this terrible mistake? Often we truly believe that there is some there must be someone who really has it all together and know just what to do in every situation. Where is that person anyways? Maybe we can ask the right questions and get the right information and then no one will be suspected of our charade. You're it, honey. Go for it. So, again, it's like we know we're worthy of it, but sometimes we don't feel like it. And, you know, sometimes things don't really come with the handbook, whether it's raising kids, whether it's like, you know, not reading a contract correctly, and that's okay to ask for help, but just know that those limiting thoughts and beliefs will not serve you. It's really, you know, it's about going to the root of the issues and figuring out like, you know, why do I feel like I am not worthy of this when you've done the research, you've done the studies, you've done everything, and now it's, for you to implement that and of course everything's a learning experience we are human we are you know going to make mistakes here and there but that's okay isn't it isn't it isn't it okay so moving on let it be let it be let it be illy be <laughs> um shuaha Sometimes we need to recognize when something is blocking us in our lives and release it. It could be a thought that doesn't serve us, right? About how we think that we're not able to do something or who put us in charge. Um, where was I? Okay, I'm gonna read it. Sometimes we need to recognize when something is blocking us in our lives and release it. It could be a thought that doesn't serve us, a grudge, and nagging anxiety or a situation we cannot change to let it go we chant this mantra shawaha a sanskrit term that means so be it let it be or let it burn letting go of habits ideas or relationship that no longer serve us is one of our greatest challenges we face on a daily basis but it is an essential practice for moving forward in our lives Take a deep breath, soften, and say swaha, swaha, swaha. So now I know why I got the intuition. So yeah, if we're going to read this, then, you know, let it marinate and all that stuff. So letting it go, oh, swaha, also like burning it. Again, the earth core dragons are really here. I know you guys are probably like, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> I'm, like I'm pretty sure you love it too. Um, but... Yeah, so, you know, letting it burn, those limiting thoughts and beliefs, that's exactly what they do to help us to transform as well. So, we're going to see the card of the day. What? Ooh. Hmm. Landed right here. I heal the habit of fear and I embrace the habit of love. Oh my. I love it. They all just, all these together. And look at that, the twins here. So this is like, you know, the Gemini eclipse. 
the full mini clips that happened. It's definitely did a number on me. Um, so yeah, and I feel like it's bringing up a lot of fears in order for it to really be let go and to really be in the habit of love. That's all I gotta say on that, on this, and that, and this, and that. Okay, anyways, so we are going to meditate now to take on our day to read, to say swaha. So we're going to ground, and as we ground, we're going to chant Saha. So we're going to do like the, the regular schmegular thingies of like, you know, yeah. Okay, so sitting up straight, shoulders pulled back and chin slightly tucked in, palms facing up to receive and to release, and all that good stuff. So closing your eyes. Taking your own natural breaths. Noticing your breath soften and be in unison of all of creation as you are part of this world and this life that you have a divine purpose. You have gifts to share with the world whether it's your smile, whether it's your kindness, whether it's your paintings, whether it's spoken word, whatever it may be, share it with the world and loving service to your brothers and sisters, Alex Gray. Breathing in and out. Feeling more relaxed and more grounded and seated into your seat. Breathing in and out. Going into your heart center. Breathing in. And out. As you feel more grounded and more aligned into your seat, as energetic roots now flow through your chair, through your surroundings. And as you make your way down into Mother Earth's soil, releasing your day, releasing anything that doesn't hold on to you, finding a huge, beautiful, magnetic crystal that calls out to you. You wrap your roots around this crystal and feel its energetic frequency. And at this time, we chant the mantra Swaha to really let go and to really just release, knowing that Mother Earth will transmute this energy as you will, you are not hurting her. Ready? Swaha, 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 swaha. Breathe in, breathe out. Swaha, 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 swaha. Breathe in. And as you breathe out, you're really releasing and letting go anything that doesn't serve you. Ready? Swaha, 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 swaha. Breathe in. And swaha, 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 swaha. Breathing out, letting go. One more time. Breathe in. Swaha, swaha, swaha. Feeling 
your energy now uplift as you move your way back into your body feeling a load lifted off of you going back as you enter into the earth realm of this reality and back into your room you feel lighter you feel awesome you feel vibrant you feel energetic coming back into your space back into your hearts and back into your body breathing in and out feeling more relaxed and welcome back let me know how that was. Let me know if you like this switch up better, if you like me to keep things the same, or if you like this one better. I would love to know your opinion as well. I'm hopeful you have a beautiful, magical, wonderful day. I'm sending you lots of love and blessings your way. Alrighty, kisses.